What is data science project management? Hey there, my name is Josh, I'm one of the founders of Product Manage Q, and in today's video, I'm going to break down data science product management, what it is, as well as how it's different from data product management, and also dive into what a data science product manager does, and also the opportunities that are opening up in this field. But before we get into that, don't forget to subscribe to our channel and turn on your notifications, and that way you'll know whenever we post new content. Now let's go ahead and jump in. So to understand data science product management, it's a good idea to backtrack a bit first. Because first I'll break down what used to be separate fields, data science and product management. Both roles continue to converge though as businesses demand more sophisticated data solutions. And they use these verticals to collect, store, and analyze massive volumes of customer information. Well, how massive? Forbes Magazine says internet users create 2.5 quintillion bytes of data every day. Putting this into context, datapro.net said this is equal to every ant on earth multiplied by 100. Someone needs to make sense of all this data and turn it into usable information. And this person is a data scientist. Data science is interdisciplinary. Many working in this industry have backgrounds in math, statistics, engineering, computer science, and even AI. Their main job is designing the algorithms that tease insights out of random data. But it's unusual to have data science teams that do any customer facing jobs. Product managers are all about the customer though. Product management begins in companies that made fast moving consumer goods or FMCGs. Because FMCGs depend on satisfied customers to do well, product managers have always been customer focused. They collect information about the customer from the customer if need be. They then apply what they've learned to make the product better. They also oversee every detail connected with the product lifecycle. And this brings them into contact with other areas of the company, including designers, engineers, marketing, and management. Think of the product manager as a connector of people and business processes. Technology's rise in importance to the economy guarantees a few things as well here. Businesses will incorporate more of it into their operations if they want to remain competitive. They need data analysis and be able to pull those insights out. A company that used to rely on an accounting department to process payroll, for example, may now use machine learning and algorithms and software to carry out the same function. Note that this solution would be useless if it completed a different task than what the company required though. Someone has to tell the businesses which of these data technology suits them best. As technology and software get better at what they do, the data science teams create more complex algorithms and analytical tools. And because they can, it doesn't mean there will be a final end user for that product. This calls for someone who is able to translate the company's needs to the data science team so the right products and algorithms get made. And when you combine the customer facing role of the product manager and the business facing role of the data scientist, well, you get the data science product manager. And data science product management shares characteristics with data product management, but they're not one and the same. They both handle data, but in different ways. A data science product manager is part of the data science team. They keep the team on track and make sure the team's skills solve the problems the company needs solved. They also find uses for existing data products. They identify whether the company can use them or the company's customers can. And if they decide to release a product to the public, a data science product manager becomes responsible for that product's entire life cycle from development through to launch. Now compare this to the data product manager. Data product managers take ownership of the company's internal data. They collect this data from many different points within the company, and they may use the same tools as data scientists do in order to do this. But the data product manager is not considered a data scientist perhaps. Instead, they make decisions on what happens to the company's internal data and find better methods of collection. And if the collected data needs further analysis, well, then they pass it on to the data science team. And that's why, in fact, the two roles often work in conjunction with each other. And data science product management is still in its infancy. Many companies are only now beginning to realize that they need someone to perform this job. As a result, the positions that exist are well compensated. So as of recent, Glassdoor says data science product managers can expect to earn $151,450 per year on average. And another salary site quotes an average base salary of 130,000 a year. And with that said, some of the other sites listed even higher salaries ranging from 170,000 to 190,000. And because this field is still new, its career path is still emerging. Right now, traditional data scientists and product managers are the ones who are taking on these roles. If you are a data scientist or you're working in data analytics somehow, and you're hoping to move into data science, product management, 
It helps to take business courses. And this will supplement your knowledge of that side of the company's operations. And if you are in product management, you should learn programming languages like Python and SQL. While it's not necessary that you know how to code, leaders in the field think it will become important. And if you are completely new to either, you'll have to get training in both areas. And this will be challenging, but not as tough as you might think. Data science is still a new field, and many of the paths leading to it are non-traditional. There are online courses and videos for learning the basics. And for more advanced training, you'll have to get a degree in data science or a technical business or mathematical field, or even a certification in data product management, which we offer on Product Manager HQ. And you should also apply for entry-level jobs in data science or product management to get experience. And some titles to look out for are machine learning analysts and data analysts and associate or junior product manager. More senior roles in data science project management will need a master's or even doctoral degrees in business and technical areas. And there you have it. Now you know what data science product management is and how it's different from data product management. You've also learned what you need to become a data science product manager. And again, my name is Josh. I'm one of the founders here at Product HQ. Thank you for watching this video and make sure to remember to subscribe to our channel for more notifications when we come out with really helpful content on how to become better with product management, data, and many of the other topics that you're likely interested in. And with that, I'll go ahead and see you on some of our other videos. Cheers.